Wireless keyboards are great, but they're big and bulky and not easy to transport. That's where something like this, the folding Proto Arc keyboard, comes in handy. Are you interested? Let's get started. Hello, I am Wanderer001, and this is my review of the Proto Arc XK01 Trifold Bluetooth keyboard. I do want to start this review off with prefacing that ProtoArt did reach out to me and provide me with this folding keyboard for the purposes of doing an unbiased review. So that's what you're going to get here. I will admit I was looking for a mobile portable keyboard so that when I go away on conferences for my actual day job, I would be able to type on something instead of the Surface Pro screen or my cell phone. That's one of the things with this particular keyboard is it is a Bluetooth keyboard. As denoted up here in the corner, you can see one, two, and three. That means you can have this keyboard set up to attach to three different devices. So I could switch between that horrible Surface Pro, my smartphone, and another device if I wanted to. Obviously, you cannot have them all at once, but you can switch between them. Let's talk about dimensions. Right now, it is in its open state, which is its full keyboard array, giving you a complete 105 keys, including a number pad, which I really appreciate. I do like having a number pad because, well, in my day job, I do utilize the number pad quite extensively, which is also why I got that particular keyboard that you saw at the beginning of this review. Now, because this is a foldable keyboard, size is important. When it's in its fully open state, as you see here, it has a width of 10.5 inches and a height of 4.71, and its actual width is less than half an inch, which is very important. When it's in its closed state like this, you're looking at 8.4 inches by just five inches and has a width of about half an inch. Now, while we have it in its closed state, we'll kind of take a quick walk around. You can see underneath here, there are little rubber feeties. So when it's open, it stays in place and doesn't scratch the surface that you happen to have it on. Over here on the sides, you can see we have our hinges on the back or what I'm going to call the bottom, which is the part that faces you. There are, there's nothing there. But if we spin this around, you can see right there, there is one USB-C charging port because this is a Bluetooth battery powered device. When we come over here, you can see a lot of the back end here is taken up by that battery. This is a 210 milliamp battery, which has a battery life, they say, of roughly six months, depending on actual usage. If you're using this every day on multiple devices, that's going to be eaten up a lot faster. Charge time, not terrible. It is USB-C. And because it's USB-C and at the top of the keyboard when it's in its open state facing away from you, you actually can charge and use this device at the same time. Now here we come to our hinges right there. You can see how that actually actuates right there. And based on ProtoArch website, they say you can get a hundred thousand actuations of those hinges and not have it damage the device in any way shape or form and continue to function perfectly fine which is a stated 13 year equivalent well depending on again actual usage if i'm taking this in and out of my bag quite a lot and opening and closing it it's not going to last quite as long but it's really durable from my testing so far and the fact that it's a full keyboard, I really much appreciate. I mean, look, you have all 12 of your function keys, you've got your print screen and this. The numpad for me is just, I can't believe that this is on a folding keyboard. Now, while it might not be as important for you because it's a folding keyboard, you know you're not going to get the same feel as you would from an actual keyboard or even a mechanical keyboard because these are just using plastic X switches but some people might be interested in what this actually sounds like for usage. So let's take a quick listen as to what the keys sound like with our foldable keyboard here. Coming back, if we kind of pop up to the top here, I'm gonna open and shut it one more time because this has an auto power on and auto sleep mode. So when it actually attaches itself, there'll be blinking lights here, right there you can see one, a slow blink means it's already attached to something. This keyboard is attached to my cell phone, which is slightly off camera there. If I were to change this to number two, you could see it is blinking rapidly, meaning that it can be attached to something, but is not currently at this time. Now let's talk about the front of our keyboard a little more. Here you can see there are little rubber stanchions in each of the corner and that helps it to 
when it's in its closed state, not put pressure on those actual keys. So that helps to preserve your key life. And if we pick it up and show you this way, you can kind of see the ends do flex out a little bit. So if you're going to be using this on your lap, you wanna make sure that you have a kind of situation like this, where this is sitting across your knees so that part of this and part of this side is resting on your legs. If you were to take it all the way out to the ends here, this will fold up on itself and not stay in place. If you happen to leave this out and open, don't worry, it has an automatic 30 minute sleep timer, which will allow it to preserve that battery, which helps extend its life, which is great. I know this is a very niche device and not a lot of people will be thinking, hey, I need a portable keyboard. But let me tell you, I was pleasantly surprised when ProtoArc sent this to me because yes, I was looking for a foldable keyboard to bring with me for work. And you know, you've seen the laser ones that you type on the desk and things like, they're not that great. This is a full size usable keyboard. I have already taken this to conferences and typed with it on my lap and had people ask me about it. So if you were in the market for a foldable, decent, full size keyboard for whatever purposes you have, or need it for, I highly recommend checking out the ProtoArc XK01 Trifold Bluetooth keyboard. This is exactly what you're looking for for your portable keyboard needs. With that being said, I have been Wanderer001. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them in the area below. And as always, thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, consider giving it a like as that will help other people find the video as well. If you like what I'm doing here, you can always help fuel the next review by buying me a coffee. Link in the description below. Last but not least, if you want to be notified when I upload a new video, you know what to do.